I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. I'm here. Okay. Hey guys, I'm Megan. I'm Wendy. And today we are sharing our February favorites. I have another hit from L'Oreal Hair Care Line. This was in the last Target Beauty Box, and this is the L'Oreal Boosted Air Blown Texture Mist. This is a volumizing spray, and lo, is it glorious! You guys, have you used this? Once or twice. You're not a fan? I like the L'Oreal line a lot. This is a knock in your socks off? It left a weird texture in my hair. Which it's supposed to! It's supposed to! I spray this on before I blow dry my hair, and then I blow dry my hair. I have a lot of hair to begin with, so... That doesn't necessarily mean volume, though. Sometimes I have flat a lot of hair, and lately, <laughs> you guys... I've got volume. The first one is the Nip and Fab Glycolic Wipes. Now, do you remember these? I do, I use them. Yeah, they came in a little itty bitty, like little sample size, and they were great. They look like, remember Clearasil pads? Totally. But they smell good, and they have like glycolic on it, and I need all the help I can get. I love these. They're probably like 10 or 12 bucks at oh. Target. Yeah, they were, these are great. Keeping with the subscription box love, I have the Sweet Emotions, what is this, Pumpkin Facial Mask. This was in a Glowing Beats box. This, masks on my skin don't always play nicely together. My skin is very easily irritated. But this is a mask that has a lot of oils in it. It's kind of like, um, you can see the oil sitting on oh, top. Oh boy. Um, you see it mixed back in. But it is kind of like a mud consistency. It doesn't dry down on the face. It is very hydrating and it soothes my skin. My skin, our weather's been bizarre here. It's 90 degrees right now and it's kind of been bouncing back and forth and my skin has been freaking out a little bit. And so I it, used this the other day and it really just kind of calmed everything down. And it leaves, have you used this? Yes. Do you like it? I love it. It leaves kind of like a finish, like an oily, not in a bad way, like if you were to apply a facial oil, mm -hmm. it kind of leaves your skin feeling like very, this is definitely a nighttime thing because you want to go to bed with those on your face. I really, really like this. Speaking of glowing beads, this little gem, this is Little Barn Apothecary Charcoal and Aloe Facial Cleanser, and I love it. I love the smell of it. It smells like black licorice, right? Uh, yeah, exactly. And I thought, I don't see anything in it. It's What's got to smell like black licorice? A niece or something yeah. like that, but I don't see that on here. Anyway, it's great. Have you tried this? Yes. Do you like it? Yes. Does it irritate your skin? It doesn't, but I don't change up my face wash very often, oh. so I'll use that every once in a while, but I'm very, very, like, loyal with my face wash. Oh, you are? Yeah. See, I've been trying to change things up because my face is going through some really weird changes. And it wants to be 12 and it wants to be 40 and <laughs> it can't decide. So I'm just trying like a lot of everything to see yeah. what's going to work. And this stuff is great. And I'm not using it every night, maybe like every three nights, maybe on the weekend. But Kind of like a deeper cleanser. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that charcoal really does dry everything out of your skin. Yes, and that's what I like about it. And you know I'm guilty of sometimes going to bed without washing my face. So a deep clean is needed a lot for me. Go on. Next up is the... Such a, I have words about this. Go. Oh, oh, good words? I hope so. Yeah, because you gave it to me for Christmas. Oh, I did? <laughs> <laughs> this is the Mary Kay Mint Bliss Energizing Lotion for Feet and Legs. A friend of mine sells Mary Kay and had a little boutique at Christmas, and I went and cleaned her out. This stuff is really good on my feet. I, in the past several years, my feet, I have a very hard time keeping them looking pretty. And this really works for me. I have been using this a lot. It is sadly sandal weather in February, and I really enjoy this. Listen, my dogs were barking the other day. And I, <laughs> I was like, I need something for them. And I found this mint cream, lotion, whatever it's called, and it just did the trick. Yes. Remember how I was telling you I need some deep cleansing? We got this in Pure Box, which is Unfortunately, not available any longer, but this was a combo. It's by Bloom. It's a glow oil tonic and then this dry powder that you mix together, a polish, which smell this. It doesn't smell good. It smells like food, I think. Yeah, it smells like breadcrumbs. <laughs> it does. Yeah. It does. But it does. 
Italian bread crumbs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but for some reason, put these two together and kapow! My face <laughs> is like an Italian supper. <laughs> it, I mean, it's it makes it so soft and glorious. I love it. So I've been using it on the weekends. And I do it like all down here because this is getting very old looking. So Wendy gets real fancy with her skincare regimen on the weekends. <laughs> it's because I neglect all week long. That's why. <laughs> this is obviously a trial size, sample size product. But I really like it. This is the Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer Hydrating Primer. Oh, now, boy. I do still love my L'Oreal Finishing Spray as yes. a primer. I like it very much. It holds on to my makeup. But what that spray does not do is even out the surface of mm -hmm. my skin. Yeah. And this does that in addition to holding on to the makeup and helping it not slip off my face. I have discovered that I cannot wear makeup without some sort of primer. We've re reached that age, I think. It's so bizarre because I didn't really... I wasn't so sure that the primer was doing anything mm -hmm. until one morning I got ready without it and two hours later my makeup is gone. You're like, what? Do not look, no. <laughs> so I am kind of sad that I loved this. This was in the Sephora Favorite Superstar set. They could have given you a bigger size. Jeez. Well, this lasts, I mean, I'm still using it. It lasts a decent amount of time because you don't need very much. And it's not a silicone-based primer, which I like very much. Mm -hmm. But I'm just kind of sad because I know this is not my normal drugstore price. Mm. But I might have to splurge. This is not from a box. This is from Target. And... I don't know if you can see it. It's the Pacifica Natural Skin Care Sea Foam Facial Wash. Um, I'm trying, I'm just getting lazy at night, so I'm just trying to like switch things up to yeah. make myself non lazy, and I wanted to get a new facial cleanser. How does it smell? It's like Hawaii. Oh, I love the way Pacifica stuff smells. Yes, mm. and it's one of the natural lines carried at Target. I don't no, I don't think we ever got this in the Target box, but I probably used my three dollar coupon for it. The last thing I have is a brow product. This is the Maybelline Brow Satin. This is actually one of Wendy's cat. Did I give um, that to you? Yeah. I don't think you had ever even used it. Probably I think not. it was just like you had too much stuff. So this is the Maybelline Brow Satin in the color. No idea. That's an Does angle. not have a color on here anywhere. Don't they do that? Yeah, don't do that to me. So it's this color. Tote, tote. Probably. Yeah. And it has, on one end, it has a twist-up eyebrow pencil filler in it. All right, I did not use that. No, you didn't. Okay. And on the other end, it has this powder that you fill in with. And if, like me, you have blonde eyebrows that are invisible and you have to fill them in daily, this is kind of a nice combo product because you can kind of outline them, fill in the base with the pencil side, and then smooth it out finish up the filling with the powder. I really enjoy this. Are you wearing it now? I am. Okay, my last item came in a Glowing Beats box and it is by Fit Glow, which is a company we both really like. This is the Renew Serum. Did you get one of these? Mine's big. I have a giant one of those. I'm devastated to hear that. Why do you have this little itty bitty one? I don't know. So, is it the same? I have the Renew Cream. You have oh, the Renew Serum. serum. When did we get these in the did she send that to you for Christmas? Maybe? I don't remember. It's from it came in a box. Beats. Yeah, I think it came in a box, but that's interesting because why wouldn't we have noticed when we unboxed the stuff that they were just why I'm wondering if you got it in your Christmas gift. I don't remember, but I'm telling you, I freaking love it. It has like the um, AHAs and the hyaluronic acid, and there was something else. Oh, retinol, which I need. And yeah, it's. So I've been using the Renew Cream um, and really liking it. I wonder how much different the serum is. This is Wonder Power Activate if you put it together. <laughs> Maybe I need to go to Fit Glow. And I have been using this at night too. Does that have retinol in it too? No, but this has hyaluronic acid. It does not have retinol. Mm. All right, you guys, those are our favorites for the month of February. That is stuff that we are loving and using, and this is a great way that we kind of you see all the stuff we get, and then we can share back the stuff that we love. Yeah. Let us know what you are loving. If you like these favorites videos, please give this one a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so yet, if you are new to our channel, welcome. And we would love it if you would clicky-clicky the subscribe button. And we'll see you in another video very soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.